Delicious, smack delicious. Mm -mm. <clears throat> oh <my> <clears throat> Smack delicious, smack delicious. Somebody mad? They talking shit. Fuck you. Me and your man, me too. I don't give a fuck. What you talking about, nigga? <laughs> Must be a nigga because I said it. Must be a nigga because I said it. Mm -hmm. Close my blinds. Mm -hmm. They must be watching you. Mm -hmm. I don't just talk about that shit. It's not too bad. Mm -hmm. Mm, let's see what's going on, y'all. Mm, sorry, y'all had to eat. Oh, Holy Spirit, let me use my sister. Guys, what are the messages here? Put my cup up there. What do they need to know? Maybe not, y'all. Nothing coming up. Uh-oh. Evil eye. This motherfucker over here. I told you somebody was watching shooting you the motherfucking evil eye. They wishing bad upon you. That shit ain't gonna work. They can keep on wishing what they wishing ass. Mm -hmm. Keep on fucking wishing with your wishing ass. You keep wishing. <laughs> your wishes, dreams, your dream ain't coming true. This wish ain't coming fuck true. Oh, yup. Bitch, you a liar. You know, we're shooting a goddamn evil eye. Somebody here, they mad about your soulmate over a fucking soulmate. Some of y'all, this could be a fucking soulmate, but I don't think there's no soulmate. There's somebody who mad that you got a soulmate. That's what it is, yo. They were lying, shooting you the motherfucking evil eye, calling you a liar about you having a motherfucking soulmate. Bitch, you got a motherfucking soulmate. He right here with your ass. Judgment day is here. That's why this motherfucker's being judged. That They judging your relationship with your motherfucking soulmate and was lying. Simple as fucking that. Lying and now they under judgment. Get the fuck out of here. Liberation from all restriction. This is somebody you emancipated your ass from. Let go. You threw up the motherfucker was a burden. You let go of this motherfucker. This motherfucker was a goddamn burden. You call judgment. Let they motherfucking ass go. Some of y'all, y'all, this could have been your soulmate. But I feel like somebody whoever's shooting an evil eye. This soulmate ain't shooting no evil eye. They over here looking at your ass. Hell yeah. Meanwhile, somebody over here mad because they see the goddamn truth over here. They were a goddamn lie. And somebody over here, judgment day is here. If someone had a fucking awakening, some form of transformation happened, they were lying, yo. Know? Mm -hmm. They made the wrong judgment call. That's what happened. Yep, it's one you freed yourself from, yo. Know? Somebody is, someone needs to talk. Wait, someone needs to take care of their health. This in a reverse, yo. They could have been trying to send some sickness your way. That shit's in a reverse. This is someone who sold bad seeds. That's what they try to do. They try to tip somebody. They could have said some shit about you or your person saying some shit about sowing bad seeds. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. This is someone who you let go. Because you ain't want no more. You ain't want no more burdens. This is somebody who could have sold bad seeds. They burdened by that shit. Maybe because you threw your hands up. You let this motherfucker go. Hell yeah. This somebody here. Someone is doing way too much. Someone let go because they was doing way too much. That's why. They let go of these fucking burdens. Hell yeah. And that's probably what they were lying and was saying about you. I'm mad that all my cards are like this, yo. They all mixed up, y'all. Got time to be trying to go through them. Yeah, somebody here could be mixed up. They could have tried the co the competition. They 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 probably in some form of mix up when it comes to the competition. The X factor, your goddamn X. We just said this. We just talked about that. And they always shoot you the motherfucking evil eye because you done emancipated from this nigga. You don't fuck with that nigga and none of that shit. They mad. Cause look, they single. This is somebody who's independent, single, done let the fuck go. They mad. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, attachments available to date. Somebody cut somebody off. Harsh, cold with it. I ain't mad. Maybe because they're single, you don't cut them off. They was out here with some fucking partners taking risks and shit. <clears throat> now I feel like they made the wrong decision. Some shit that's irreconcilable now. Something y'all not compatible on. You not talking. Some shit you just can't. And this motherfucker shooting you the goddamn evil eye, hating and shit. Because they feel like you're one up in them. Fuck, they do that. At? Why? Because you taking care of yourself. You like, you know, take, improving yourself, taking care of your life, doing what the fuck you want to do. 
and they mad. They don't want. They want some form of control of what the fuck going on. This somebody who's reminiscing, looking back at the past, shooting you the fucking evil eye, thinking about the past. Like there's somebody here. You've changed. You totally different, and they trying to judge you off some past actions, moves, shit like that. They shooting you this evil eye. This motherfucker lying. He lying about some shit that happened all old as fuck. Some shit that happened back in the motherfucking day. Yeah, trying to come some, trying, trying, trying to talk about that's the reason why they ain't look back and all this shit. No, nigga, stop motherfucking lying, yo. You talking about some old ass shit. Talk about some current events. They can't come with that. That's why. And now Judgment Day is here. Somebody got a motherfucking soulmate. This motherfucker feels emancipated, yo, because you done dropped their ass. They were fucking burdened. You let they ass go, and now they got a new fucking perspective over here. This is somebody who's shooting you the goddamn evil eye. Somebody, you not looking back. Them good times is gone. This motherfucker feels empty, lost, because you cut they ass off. And they mad. Uh -huh. Girl, that nigga grunting over there. Locked, detached, locked away heart. Can't move forward. Your person can't move forward. That's what the fuck it is. And they lying to themselves. And they see you over some fucking... They feel like a fucking clown out this bitch. Your person feel like a fucking clown, yo. Because you done. You walk the fuck off, you walk the fuck away, and you fucking done. You going towards, yo, know, this could have been somebody's soulmate, somebody called judgment on. Someone had an awakening. Someone here renewed it. Some form of, yeah, they, someone set a new intention, a new focus with judgment on a soulmate. And somebody here from the past feels lost without you because you detached. They feel ashamed, humiliated, feel because you're done. And they fired up about that shit. They still mad about that shit. Yep, because they were in their ego. Whatever the fuck they were saying, they were fucking lying. Mm -hmm. And shooting you the motherfucking evil eye. Yep. And this is someone you let go, you walked away, you was completely done, yo. You were done. That was it. Diamond ring, loyalty is here. Someone here could have been in a marriage. Someone here could be wanting to get married. Someone here could be coming in, giving a marriage. Somebody watching somebody get go towards a marriage. Somebody was being incognito, acting like, you know, some shit I do not know. You deserve much better. Maybe they see that. Maybe they realize that. And maybe they see you getting that now. But judgment coming. Yep. Now they, look, this shit done. This shit done. Part of the middle of the day. Karmic lesson. Person learned a motherfucking karmic lesson over here, yo. They got the, they gave the wrong impression. Because they kept talking about the past and shit that was old and shit. Fuck out of here. And, and now you're going towards something that was traditional. A marriage, a commitment. Hey, I told you a nigga was mad, yo. This motherfucker was doing black magic. And this shit, this motherfucker got the goddamn clown now. Mm, mm, mm. Because somebody here is done. Completely done. They feel abandoned and neglected, bitch. Because that black magic was disregarded. Avoided. Blocked. This motherfucker, they couldn't do nothing. They look like they feel ashamed, yo. That shit was ignored. So and so was this person. This I'm telling you, they don't want you to go towards this guy. I'm telling you, this is what it was. And they mad about this shit. They learned a lesson. There's somebody here who wanted some form of power. Yeah, when they came to some form of childhood influence, they was fucking with somebody. Call themselves trying to stunt on your ass. Rolling, taking some form of risk, yo. And look, this shit blew up in their motherfucking face. They don't cause the mess. When it came to the past, that's why they having these memories. This motherfucker needed to be cautious. Now, mm -mm, they got tempted with some lust. Somebody here, there's an ending. Somebody could be finding out that somebody could be dying. Mm -mm. Don't ask me. They, they Look, they sent that shit. Don't ask me. Then now they see him being incognito, discreet. I don't know who the fuck sent it. But they trying to hide it. Somebody in their feelings. That's who the fuck it was. Somebody who was in their motherfucking feelings. They feel like an ass now. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Yep. <clears throat> we got Cathedral with the loyalty. Somebody got the wrong fucking impression. Damn, they learning a karmic lesson. That spell work ain't, ma ain't working. Mm -hmm. And yeah, this person feels like a clown. They looking. They see you with your soulmate. They were lying to themselves, yo. This is someone you that's walking away. They could be moving on. They learn some form of lesson. Karmic lesson. Yep. And when it came to their loyalty to you, they gave the wrong fucking impression. Somebody sees that, I see. That's what it looked like. This is someone who's, I don't know, maybe they told them, you know, you know, about you or some shit. But they were lying to whoever this person was. 
Someone could have been shooting you the evil eye just because someone was talking bad about you, but they were lying. And now this motherfucker look like a, qu a clown over here. Maybe they were lying to someone just so someone could do magic and stop your ass, but that was a lie. Hey, this motherfucker's lost. Empty, yo. Mm-mm. Detached, cold, can't move forward. Mm -mm. Observing you. Because they got karma. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. -mm -mm -mm. That black magic came back and they tried. Yo, they got karma for trying to trying to see if this fucking black magic was working on this cathedral, this marriage. This was someone who wasn't loyal to you. They got karma here and karma here. That's why they got the wrong that that's why they got this dip this, this different outlook now. Yeah, that your ass was protected. Hell yeah. They they want to take every opportunity to come for you. Your stability and everything, yo. Every opportunity. And they got fucking karma doing that shit. When it came to this goddamn black magic. And they was trying to do every opportunity to stop this shit. This cathedral, this marriage. That's why judgment came down. Now they feel humiliated and ashamed. This, I said they were watching you. This somebody with some fucking hawk eyes. I told you, they, you know, they were hawk watching. We already know that. Same cards keep coming out. That's why God is making all these changes, yo. You might as well. Girl, I had plans too. God done changed them plans. Shit. Water sign. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. You could be. They could be. But somebody fucking here is, yo. They in a love drought. They could be trying to cause that shit on you. Help form a love drought. No ordinary love. This motherfucker, he's going to mad. Lifeline. This motherfucker don't want to lose you. That's why they doing this shit. But that's like, they can't do that. You cannot manipulate you guys and, and then want to do magic to try and stop because they're in their emotions. They're in their feelings that they didn't commit, that they feel like a clown, that they watching you over here. Someone, yeah, someone now is going through some form of deep awakening over here. This passion and fucking desire over here. Someone has had some form of, they made the wrong judgment. It was the wrong judgment call. Someone's awaiting for some form of union. Mm -mm. They've been caught up in a web of lies. They was talking about your union. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And now someone made poor judgment. They left you waiting for this union. And now they've been caught up in a web of fucking lies. Your person has now woken up. Some form of passion, desire, all them shits. They, have, they stuck at a goddamn crossroad over here. Your person made a poor judgment call. And now they stuck at a fucking crossroad. They can't move forward. You already saw what he said. This man is locked. He cannot move forward. It feels like a fucking clown. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yep, they got karma. Every which way but loose because they made poor judgment. That's why they in their emotions and their feelings and shit. They made poor fucking judgment. Let's try these. The Tales from the Heart Oracle. Oh, yeah, I got another deck coming to you. I hope y'all like that deck. I don't think I'm done with the uh, Love Oracle ones now. I think I'm going to go on to another deck. Let me see. I found one on here. This site where I got these and these so far. I got a bunch of them here. All right, Holy Spirit. Angels, answers to guys. Tell me about this here. We want two cards on this. This is somebody like here. They're shooting you the evil eye lion, the pleading man. This man is trying to cop please to you, niggas. The pleading man. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, the pleading man. Let's see what this shit is about. Mm -mm. Forbidden fruit. Damn, they cop and please. That's why unfinished business. Someone here has unfinished business in some form of relationship, some form of loyalty. Somebody here, some form of unfinished business someone could have had with someone here. They learned some form of lesson. Mm -hmm. And someone was out here with some form of forbidden fruit. They lacked commitment when it came to some form of forbidden fruit. Somebody's ancestors is here protecting the shit out of this shit right here. Yes, child. Whatever they trying to do over here. Somebody ancestors protecting the shit out of this. This person is drinking in pain. But someone ancestors is sitting right the fuck here. Whatever this person trying to bring. Some some form of temptation with someone who has unfinished business. Male, female here. They trying to get somebody to tempt someone. Oh, no. To give them something. Uh-uh. Someone's ancestors is here. This is somebody who has some deep ancestral roots. Some form of African roots, Egyptian, ancient knowledge. This is someone who don't motherfucking play Blackfoot Indian. But yeah, 
they not playing that shit. Three of them motherfuckers. And that shit, they beating the shit out of this one over here. Whoever this one is that's trying to do it, uh-uh, that shit ain't working. This person feels person feel some form of shame, yo. Uh-huh. Because they tried to tempt you. And then someone got the wrong fucking impression about your ass. Hell yeah. When it came to this unfinished business. Yup, some form of true loyalty was here with unfinished business. They got the wrong impression. They thought you was going to be out here in the motherfucking streets and shit. Your ancestors was here when it came to you going down that goddamn aisle. They not playing with your ass and your soulmate. And they feel, your, your person over here, somebody, your person feel clown, you know, that they try to detach you from someone. And someone's ancestors ain't allowing that shit. This person's catching hella karma. Yup, time stamp. The time is up. They've been trying to do this shit, yo. This is somebody who don't want to let you go. They don't want to let you go, yo. Yo, they crying, yo, at night. They crying themselves asleep. Mm-hmm. Your person is crying themselves to sleep, collectively. Yup, they crying themselves to sleep. Let me tell you that right now. They sure are, because they got, they, yo, they got karma. Look at what the fuck they tried to do, bitch. They was always shooting you the evil eye, lying on your ass, talking about your ass. They was talking about some old ass shit. When I tell you old ass shit, it wasn't even no, no. And that shit, yo, whatever they tried to send, that shit got dismissed. Mm -mm -mm. They made a poor judgment, and yo, and yo, and they, and they realized that shit, yo. They be up crying. Look at them, guilty as charged. No sorries allowed. Y'all not accepted. This person want to come and say sorry. They going through some form of obsession, the butterfly effect, because you're done. Yep. This person was a jack of all trades and a master of none. Hell yeah. Damn, look at that shit. And y'all, somebody over here, you guilty. Somebody's done. They don't want to hear that shit. No sorries allowed. Do you see that shit? And they crying about that because they know they guilty about some shit. Someone could have been in jail. Someone could be in jail. Someone no sorry is allowed. Someone could have got out of jail trying to come towards somebody. This person is heartbroken. Maybe because they didn't do you right. Their time was up. Mm -mm. And I think they know it. Mm -mm -mm. Yep. They fucking know it. Poor judgment. Poor judgment on your person's end, yo. They made the wrong choice, yo. And now... Too late. My niggas over here moving on. This person's in they mo their their emotions. I'm here and pick up your feelings. Yup, your person. Yup, look at them. They got these silent cries. Damn, at night, cause they know they guilty. Damn. Damn, how the fuck you come back from that shit? They talked all that shit, and now they fucking guilty. Mm hmm. Yep. Let me see what your person want to say. What is it that the collective's person want to say to the collective? What does the collective's person want to say to my collective about how they lie? Tell us about that part. What the fuck do they got to say about how they lied on the collective and shit? Hell yeah, someone who was running away, couldn't face it. I cannot be what you want me to be. Mm -mm -mm. So they lied on you instead of them admitting that they couldn't be what the fuck you wanted them to be. So instead they lied and shot the evil eye. And the truth is, I need you. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Mm -mm. That forbidden fruit, they 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 they, they could have needed that. Y'all might feel like, nah, you need that forbidden fruit. That's who you chose, or that's somebody here feels like they needed you. They done slammed down on that shit. Whatever this was, I do not know. You're the one I envision having a family with. Mm. That one keeps coming out a lot. All these cars, and that one keeps coming out a lot. So I feel like this person really does envision you being the one that they, you know, had a having a family with, having a family with. I'm not ignoring you on purpose. I'm working on myself. So some of y'all, your person could be working on themselves. You might feel like they're ignoring you. You know, they might, you know, could be working on themselves. They're not ignoring you on purpose. They saying that they need you and that you're the one that they envision having a family with. Somebody here, they just couldn't be what you wanted them to be. That's why 
They're not ignoring you. They're just working on themselves so they can be who you want them to be. Mm. I don't see no red out here, so some form of lights. Maybe they got some form of an awakening. They, they've now come to the light. Yeah, with that bookshelf and karmic, some, somebody here has learned some lesson. Yeah, one more here. Thank you. We can make each other better. Wow. They feel like that. You guys both can make each other better. Wow. I just want to see you, hug you, tick, touch you, and kiss you. I heard tickle you. Some of y'all. Wow. That's what they want to do. I want to feel your touch. Yeah, they want to tickle you. You deserve so much better. Maybe they want to make you laugh. They want to make you happy again with them. Yeah, you may not be happy with this person. This person wants you to be happy with them again. So maybe that's why they want to tickle you is what I'm hearing. Uh-huh. Maybe someone's name. Mm-hmm. I'm hearing Teddy. But yeah, I love you. This person loves you. And they feel y'all can make each other better. I feel your energy everywhere I go. So even though for some of y'all, y'all might be apart from your person, they can still feel your energy everywhere they go. Mm -mm. Wow. I know I caused you so much pain. So they know what they did when they did this forbidden fruit. I'm afraid to show you who I really am. I feel like their ancestors are showing them exactly who they really are. Mm. And that's probably why they realize their time is up and then they're silently crying at night. I'm trying to become a better version of myself twice. This person is definitely trying to become a version, a better version. But y'all, the time stamp is here. What does that mean? When that time stamp is here, that means the time is up. That's what that means. That damn time is up. Let's see, y'all. Mm -hmm. I don't know what the hell. What the hell is time stamp? Divine timing is at play in your love life. Your love life is on a hold for now. Patience. Wow. So right now, y'all love life is on a hold. It was my fault. I'm to blame. Damn. And they laying in that bed thinking about that, feeling guilty about this shit. And some, because somebody here is not, some, no sort, no sorries allowed. The butterfly effect. Y'all have transformed fully, I feel. Yup. Y'all have transformed. And this person know they're guilty of it. Yo, they guilty. Mm -mm -mm. And he even said it. I said, what messages does your person want to say to you? This is what the fuck they want to tell you. It was their fault and they are to blame. Mm. Damn, no. But they need to tell you that to your face. They try to tell you through these goddamn cards. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. What they thinking, they not saying. But they know. Mm -mm. That's a damn shame. I need more balance. They need more balance because they're trying to work on themselves. They're trying to become a better version. We don't saw that two or three times. I'm trying to become a, a better version. They need more balance. I want a fresh start with you. So they want to start fresh in this relationship. They don't want, you know, no forbidden fruit. They don't want to be tempted. Yeah. Damn. I'm manifesting you. Bitch, they manifesting you. We got 112. Maybe that song 112. Mm-hmm. Peaches and cream. Mm-mm. I dream about you a lot. LOL. Too much. That's what I saw. Yep. 7112 could be someone's number, but two, three, four. Yeah, this is somebody here that wants to hold on to you and they trying to become a better version of themselves, child. Damn. Girl. They want a fresh start. They afraid to show you this. I think because they have, they feel like you you may reject them. Mm hmm. I've never imagined so much perfection. Damn, nine one one. This shit is an emergency. Damn, that they they that they heal. They feel like you know this shit is like some form of emergency. It's a time stamp on this. Damn. Mm hmm. Nine ten eleven twelve thirteen. Some form of ending. Mm -mm -mm. They could be trying to manifest you back by becoming a better version of themselves. Damn. It's someone they know they caused you a lot of pain. But 
they're trying to manifest you because they never imagined so much perfection. You guys may have unfinished business. And now they talking about you the one. Wait. They want you to wait, bitch. Wait until they ass get done. Listen to your heart. They want like they like listen to your heart. Listen to your heart. What does your heart say? Mm-mm. Damn, y'all listen to your heart. Eleven. This love scares me. Eleven seven. Mm-mm. This love scares me. Listen to your heart. That's what someone's heart is saying. This love scares me. So someone here, they feel like they learned some lessons, some form of justice, truth in the matter. This love scares me. That's exactly what I feel. And so that can be the reason why they're not acting on it. Because they may not trust. This is someone with a big heart, a lot of love. And 11, 8, 18, and someone's hiding that this love scares them. Words do hurt. It's hurting this, your person to know that you're scared to love them. Damn. Because they hurt you. And that's the truth. King of Swords. Damn. They see that shit. You're making a hit over heart decision and you're detaching. They're burdened by that shit. We already talked about them burdens. Mm -hmm. This emancipation over here. They feel like you're emancipating them. You're leaving them. This someone could be having health problems because of this shit, yo. They need to eat some fruits and vegetables. They over here losing their motherfucking mind. Awaiting for this goddamn union. And they caught in a web of lies. Somebody here who they was passionate and desire for. And they aw awaken now. That they're stuck. <laughs> person is stuck they made poor judgment it's their fault mm -mm -mm. Yep. damn that shit crazy did i part this back mm -mm. yep this shit crazy your person over here tripping will of fortune in reverse my car is upside down damn and the king of king of wands in reverse they know they were involved in some shit. They know they were living a double life. That's why they got this bad karma. Some ex extreme excessive ass, a backstab betrayed. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Damn, when they backstab betrayed you, somebody got excessive extreme karma. Bad luck, backstab betrayed. Damn. Tell me about this person. They were always shooting an evil eye and calling you a liar and shit. That King of Swords, the truth is some form of healing. The truth is they someone's made a hit over her decision. They got a new perspective. They could want to heal it with you now. Maybe, you know, someone here knows you're not healing it. Mm, yeah. Both you guys could smoke. Mm-mm. Yeah. Someone has cut someone off. I feel like they 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 know someone's not healing it. Mm -hmm. They know the angels are detaching, are helping you detach from this person. I already told you that, yo. They they realize this shit. You're you're protected. I told you that. Mm. Somebody's ancestors. They was over here, yo. Mm -hmm. Yes, they was. This is in divine's timing. Damn, and someone here made a head over heart decision that they, they're not getting this wish fulfillment to heal it with you. You could be a Sagittarius. Your person could have air in their chart or be an air sign. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody here, that love is black. Like, this could have been black love, but it looked dead. This, this love is dead. Someone here got a new perspective that this love is dead. Not healing it. You were an earth angel. You saw things, you helped them see things, and this opportunity, someone's gone. They missed it. Yeah, you're not healing it. You're you're moving on to another opportunity. Your back is turned. They're watching you. You over here. You could be healing, smoking weed, you're doing hitting a bong or some shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And somebody here, some form of opportunity somebody here took they could have took advantage of an opportunity that's why you're not healing it mm -mm. someone is detached 
I feel like you turned your back. You could be going on towards other opportunities. Yeah, you going towards someone else. You're working and collaborating. Maybe this person put you in a third party. They saw an opportunity and put you in a third party. That's the reason why you're not taking their ass back. Mm -mm. Yep, but they want an opportunity to heal it with you, to work on it, to collaborate. They made a head over heart decision now. They could be smoking a lot of cigarettes. They want to bring this love back. Someone might like to wear a lot of black, but yeah, mm. someone may have Liberty of Mutual Insurance or Geico. Yeah, this person feels like a fool. They're ready to leap. They want a fresh new start with you to work and build and collaborate. Some form of fresh new start with you. You the one that they want to work with, but they're afraid to, to show you, to tell you about wanting this new beginning with you. Because this person needs more balance, but they're wanting you to wait. Mm. Yeah, they're wanting you to wait, child. That's this change. Someone here is ready to take this leap. Mm -mm. Yep. Yeah, someone from your past, Six of Cups. Someone younger, someone older. Yeah, this is someone that wants to take some form of leap with you to work on it. They want this opportunity. For this new a second chance because now that they got this new perspective they're ready to work and collaborate you know building some form of solid opportunity they feel like you their bitch mm -mm, yeah they feel like a fool that they didn't collaborate that they went towards a, another opportunity who put them in a third party they're not healing it with that bitch they cut that bitch off they being real cold and detached from that bitch they got a new perspective that this bitch wasn't no angel. Uh-huh. Just somebody who wanted an opportunity mm -hmm, to put them in some form of third party or work with them. They feel like a fool for giving this person an opportunity to work and collaborate with them. This is someone they just leaped into the unknown with. Didn't even know what the fuck was going to come out of it. And they fell. They just leaped off. Some form of could have been into the unknown. Yeah. Yeah, tell me about this King of Swords. What's going on with this King of Swords? He's detached. You see the truth. Yeah, somebody here ready to give. Somebody I feel they no longer giving. They detached with with this person. This is someone that's ready to give to you, but I feel someone got a new perspective here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Somebody here ready to go into the unknown. Now they ready to make a head over heart decision and want to come in and give to their angel. Your name could be angel. They could be looking at you like an angel. Mm -hmm. But this is somebody here. I feel like they're going to give you anything you want. Some of y'all could have wanted a breast job, boob job. This person is willing to pay for it. Mm -hmm. They got this new perspective. They want to like give you your wishes, you know. They see you as a wish fulfillment. They wishing, you know, that you'll want to give to this. They hoping and wishing you'll want to heal it with them. But I already told you, they feel like a fool now. Then someone that they didn't give. Yeah, that you were an earth angel. And they didn't give to the fucking earth angel. They turned their fucking back and went towards some form of opportunity with someone else. Who put them in a third party. That's why they feel so much like a fool. Told you they were juggling them. Yep. Somebody here is moving on. That's why they got this new perspective. The chariot is here. Temperance with the chariot. Someone's moving on and not healing it with this person. This person is ready to give. They see now. They want to move to a, a you know a calm place. Or they like, I just feel someone is not giving. They moving on. They're not healing it. Yeah, someone's let go. Two of pentacles in reverse. Because they were juggling them. Yep. And was giving to someone else. Yep, some form of an opportunity here. Yep, with someone here who didn't have much to offer, didn't have shit to offer. Yep, but they just wanted this opportunity to work with them, knowing that this person didn't have shit to offer. That's why they feel like a fool. They fell for someone else's bitch. Look at that dog over here. Yep. Damn. Bella. Uh-huh. Yep, they sure did. This is somebody who they were giving to. Someone got a new perspective. Someone moved on. No longer healing it with this person. Someone has that. This is why this person need more balance, more time. Yeah, because they trying to find an opportunity to come in and work on it with you for a new beginning to give and move forward. But someone here is going towards another solid 
beginnings. So I'm talking about the Page of Pentacles. This Page of Pentacles, some form of an opportunity to go work and build with someone else that they take about to take this leap towards. Because they feel like this is someone who, you know, somebody here that, you know, that, that got their back if they fall. Mm -mm. Yep, yeah, someone is moving on. Time out this page of pinnacles. Somebody here. Some form of opportunity. Mm -mm. They want to work on it now. Wow, this is a playboy playgirl. Someone's moving on. They missed that opportunity because they was out here being real impulsive. This is a hot hit. Yeah, a thrill seeker. Mm -hmm. And someone here, whoever they were with, whoever they put them in a third party with, someone's moving on. They realized this was somebody who just wanted an opportunity to sleep with them. Damn. Somebody, yup, that's why someone not healing and they moving on. Because somebody wanted the opportunity to sleep with someone here. Family, friend, or lover. And now they feel like a fool, yo. Yup. Damn. Mm-mm. Yep, somebody that they not working on it. Mm -mm. Someone could put them in a third party. This could have been someone could have been stripping for work. They was out here fucking. Somebody out here. They feel like a fool. Because they thought they were going to have this new beginning and shit. Hell no. They leaped into the unknown. Yep. Eight of Pentacles. Some playboy playgirl here. Put someone in third party. That's why someone's not working on it. Empress, that could be you. Somebody here at work, if somebody's going towards a new beginning when it comes to a marriage, when it comes to something stable, the empress is here. Someone who's beautiful, someone who's creative, yeah, someone who's passionate, inspiring, motherly, loving, mm -hmm. and someone's coming towards this person that they're attracted to, that they're working on it with, this opportunity to build and work on something here, yeah. Towards a new beginning. Yep. Someone's like putting whatever their check, paychecks and stuff is. Someone's putting their stuff in some form of marriage commitment. Mm-hmm. Wow. That's what they're giving to. Someone's coming in to give, to move forward. Someone who they're attracted to. They're working on it. And this person got a new perspective. You're marrying this person. Wow. Yep. They got a new perspective. You're no longer giving to them. They, this is over. You're not working on it. This person took an opportunity with a Playboy Playgirl to put you in a third party. And that's where this shit, you, you decided you're not working on this. This person was a fool not to marry you, not to see that you were the empress. They clearly see now. But like they said, this was Devon's timing over here. They made a poor judgment call. And they have any silent cries here. They trying to work on themselves. They somehow how they need you, but someone's completely done. They're moving on towards a new beginning. I told you that Empress is attracted to getting a new fucking beginning. That's what they give it to, and they moving forward over here. Wow, this shit just fell out of nowhere. Mm -hmm, not, and I feel like they blocking, but it kind of came out crossing like this person like can't do anything to, to block this. They were doing that magic, and that shit ain't work. That's why somebody's getting this new beginning. Nine of Wands. This is someone, some form of barrier. This is someone who wasn't prepared. They weren't prepared for this. Yup, look at them shocked about this new beginning, how somebody is moving forward here. They shocked about this new beginning and they wasn't prepared for this shit. Yup. Wow, somebody was not prepared. They were thrown off, nine of wands. Somebody is so bad seized. They fucked themselves. Yup, because someone's moving on. They got a new perspective. They fucked themselves. Yup, look at the dick. And then look at that goddamn nine of wands with those fingers. Look at the dick. And then look at those fingers going right down. They fucked themselves. Because look, that's fuck you, but that's fuck me. Yup, because somebody over here getting... Somebody here could have been fucking somebody else. They would give it to somebody else. And somebody moved the fuck on. This person fucked themselves. Cause some, cause whoever they was with, they had a playboy playgirl. Mm, 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 mm. This motherfucker fucked themselves. You were the fucking empress, and they didn't give. They was giving to somebody else who was putting them. Mm, somebody who didn't want to sleep with. I feel, but now this person here, they had a disadvantage. They weren't prepared. That they sold bad seeds. 
It's some Playboy Playgirl. Tell me about this Knight of Wands. Somebody here was not prepared. Mm. Mm -hmm. A Hierophant. They learned some form of lesson. They was not prepared. Mm -hmm. Some form of lesson here. They came to work. Some form of institution. Somebody here, a marriage. They weren't prepared. They tried to block this. And if somebody wasn't prepared, they got a new perspective. Someone's moving forward successfully and is not giving this person another opportunity to fuck them over. This is someone, yeah, who is now going towards some form of commitment, marriage, someone learning fucking lesson. This love scared this person. They're no longer working on it. They're not putting in the work with this person. This person feels like a fool that they put you in a third party. Uh -huh. Could be with someone they were working with over here. Whoever they were working with, they were sleeping with this person. Meanwhile, you were the fucking empress, yo. And now you're going to some form of brand new beginning and they're not prepared. Yup, Knight of Cups. Someone was out here, whoever they were, someone was out here dating. They could be in love. Someone could be younger. Yeah, but they learned some lesson. Maybe that they were out here dating. Mm. Yeah, someone here, they still out here dating. Yeah, but this is someone who's in love, a charmer. Yeah, I feel like you're no longer in love. You're no longer working on it with this person. They not prepared that you're going towards a brand new beginning. Somebody here, a passionate one. You attracted to someone that you're getting married to. And you're turning your back. Some form of commitment. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, somebody was in a marriage and somebody was dating outside this marriage. They wasn't prepared to find out maybe that their wife over here could have been fucking with somebody. This is someone they were giving to. Yep, 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 yep. They were taking action with a king of fucking wands and someone got bad fucking news. Yep, that they were fucking someone else. Something that they wasn't prepared for. They was investing in, in a marriage. And somebody was out here dating. Uh-uh. Yep, and slowed this shit down. This is somebody who they trusted. They thought that they were, you know, um, religious, saved. They thought they were a good guy, good girl. Yup, but they were wasting their fucking time because they found out. Somebody who they was investing weed with, too. They sowed bad seeds with that motherfucker, too. Whoever was doing business, traveling. They could have been traveling, uh, transporting shit. Someone could have went to jail. Yeah, they wasted their time here. Someone has woken up to a lesson. This could have been someone in their family. Mm -mm. That they was, yo, someone got unwelcome news. They wasted their money, their investment. Someone sold bad seeds with. Yeah, this person ain't got shit that they can offer now due to a third party. They feel like a fool that they gave something to someone to do something for them. This Playboy Playgirl, when it came to work, somebody here, Empress. Yeah, somebody was out here with someone else. This person wasn't prepared. They learned some form of lesson. Whoever this person was out here dating, someone was taking action with a king of wands, too. And they got unwelcome news. Could be about who they were fucking. They sold by seeds. They feel this was a waste, some form of investment. They invested all this shit with this motherfucker, yo, that they, they called, they wanted to grow a family with. Mm -hmm. And I feel that's what this unwelcome news, news is that they may aren't pre aren't prepared for. Someone you could have been investing with, you're going towards someone else. Somebody here, they lack commitment. They learning a lesson. Yeah, this is some form of happily ever after. Yeah. Yep. This person here, some form of new love. Wow. Someone was in a relationship with someone else. This was a new love. They wasted their money, effort, time. They sold bad seeds. They woke up. They had a major karmic lesson. Yup. Damn, with someone they saw happily ever after with who was out here dating in another relationship. That's why this person didn't take any action. This woman was out here taking action with a king of wands. That's why they feel like a fool. Somebody here who they were met at work, that they put your person in a third party, they were dating this new relationship. Yep, and somebody here got some form of opportunity to get their ass. They were fucking them over. Mm, didn't see a happily ever after with this person. Nope, and someone wasted their investment, time, money, energy. And someone moved on. 
This is someone they're not healing it. This person needed to be balanced. They got unwelcome news. They was fucking somebody else. And this person was given to them. They've divorced them now. They've divorced them because they was taking action in another fucking relationship. This person feels like a fool. Some of y'all, they feel like a fool because now you were the empress and you're moving on. You're taking fucking action with someone you could be attracted to. Wow. They want to come in now. Yup, there's been a change though. Some form of will of fortune, girl. Damn. Someone here taking some form of action now that's causing a change. It's ruling in your favor here. Wow. Yep. And they got unwelcome news. This good news is unwelcome news to them. Someone's ready to grow this family with you. Blend families, a new love with the Ten of Cups. Some form of justice is here. This person here, mm, mm, mm. there's been a change. Yep, someone is over the past. They've moved on, no longer wasting their time and in investing in this anymore. Someone got good news. Someone wants to tell you they're sorry. They want to make amends. Someone did come in and tell you they're sorry. They want to make amends. And build this family, some form of renewal of love. There's a change here. Yep, there's a change here. You a badass because you're going towards a marriage. Somebody here. Some form of celebration. Someone is over the past. They're over the regrets. They over all this shit. Some form of good news is here. You a badass bitch. Yeah, you went towards the Ten of Cups with the Four of Wands. This renewal of love. You, you Like you healed your heart. You healed yourself and you came in with something, some form of good fortune, good karma, a good life. You living a good fucking life. Look at that bitch sitting right here living a good fucking life. A badass bitch. Someone who healed and now coming in towards an, an announcement. Yup. There's some form of an announcement. Someone here is living a good life. With the will, the change here. Some form of marriage commitment. Somebody here, some form of messenger is here about healing it, saying they sorry. They watching you too. This is someone who's wasting their time. Yup, they watching. They seeing how you grow in this family, how blessings coming down, how you healed your heart. You taking action with a king of wands over here. Maybe that they didn't take any action to come in. How You know how they wasted all this time. Yeah, all this time that you've been with this person. It could be in the past to now. The future is here. It's in color. And now... Somebody has taken, they didn't, they didn't take action. Somebody else is taking action. You got good news. Five of Cups is in regret. I mean, Five of Cups is in reverse. They are in regret that they didn't marry your ass and you just got them Ten of Cups. Now they're trying to heal, take action to heal themselves here. But it's too late. Someone already knows about the good news. Told you the Knight of Cups. This is somebody who's no longer in love. They could have had a hidden agenda about trying to get you to wait. Yup, Knight of Cups. Somebody was being seduced. Mm -hmm. Yup. Damn. They were out here with someone else, seducing your person, taking action with someone else. But now they want to come in and talk to you, maybe apologize about moving on, healing this twin flame relationship. But you're a badass bitch. There's change here now. This shit has changed. They want change. Yup. Someone here could be letting go. Mm -mm. There's some change here. They want you to let go. They want some change. They ready to, they hoping you are over this. The Five of Cups in reverse. Somebody's hoping you're over it. Because they ready to send you a message. This is somebody's twin. Yep, you a badass bitch.